Hey guys, Five Guy here today, and I have some incredible news for you, and that is the nuisance indicators, the Android indicators that used to appear on the latest and greatest Android devices, Android 12, uh, features like call recording, rim cam, rim vid, uh, ambient recording. These indicators can finally be suppressed on uh, non-root Android devices. In the past, when using some of FlexiSpy's uh, more advanced features and powerful features like rim cam, ambient recording, call recording on non-rooted Android devices, then this would cause a little indicator to appear on the phone for just one or two seconds. Now, even though this was brief, it still could potentially alert the target phone device owner that their phone was being monitored, which may not be ideal in all situations. Now there was a workaround, but that required that you had to root your Android phone, and um, that comes with its own downsides, but most newer Android phones cannot be rooted, so this was not a viable solution for most people. However, if you could root your device, then you could suppress the indicators. But the news today is that now you can suppress those indicators without having to root the device. So this means that FlexiSpy's most advanced features are now available finally to the newer Android phones. So this is big news. So to suppress the indicators, you're going to have to use the FlexiSpy installation service. Now, if you've already installed FlexiSpy onto your device and you've already used the installation service in the past, uh, then that's fine. You can just go to the installation service page and the link in the description and open the live chat and tell them you want to suppress the indicators. You can then schedule your installation session, but uh, you will need the target device in your hand in order to allow them remote access onto the phone to carry out the uh, configuration to suppress the indicators. Now, if you don't have FlexiSpy already or you don't have it installed on your device already, that's fine. You can purchase FlexiSpy, use the installation service, and then they will just suppress the indicators as part of the standard installation process, so you don't have to worry about that. But again, at the moment, the only way to suppress the indicators on a non-root Android 12 device is to use the installation service. Now they may be working on a way to suppress the indicators without needing the installation service, but this is not something that we have available to us yet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to show you what it used to look like when you took a rim cam without having the indicator suppressed. Uh, then I will go ahead, I'll use the installation service and I will do the rim cam again but this time with the indicators suppressed so that you can see what the difference is. Now I'm not actually gonna go through the installation service on this video, that'll be another vi another video. But yeah, we'll, we'll do that before and after example, okay? Okay, well guys, that was a fail. Uh, I just spent about 10 minutes trying to get the indicator to appear on my Android phone uh, to no avail. I knew I hadn't suppressed the indicators yet, so I was a bit confused and then I realized going into the system settings on my phone that my phone is actually Android 12 so the indicators wouldn't appear in the first place but this is still good news uh, nonetheless and maybe I can get my hands on an Android 12 phone and uh, do a follow-up of showing the before and after with the indicators on and then the indicators off but uh, I hope this little news update was interesting for you guys and useful uh, if you want to you can always go to the FlexiSpy website using my link uh, go to the compatibility page, is my suggestion, uh, enter your device details into there and then you will see to what extent your device is compatible. Another thing that I always recommend is to use the installation service. If you've seen my other video where I install FlexiSpy uh, by myself on an Android phone in 2022, then you will know that it takes like 10-15 to 15 minutes and even for me, someone uh, who is pretty technical um, and who's done this kind of uh, installation of spy apps before, it's still kind of complicated. So to remove that headache from yourself, I would just recommend using the installation service. I think it's an extra $39 if you purchase it with uh, bundled uh, with your FlexiSpy subscription. So those are a couple of recommendations for you guys. And then if you guys have any questions about uh, what I talked about in this video, then just leave me a comment in the comments section down below and I will try and get back to you. I like answering these comments. So, uh, and then if you have any ideas for uh, other topics that you want me to cover in future videos, then please share that as well. Hope you guys found this video useful. Uh, thumbs up if you liked it. You can subscribe. Use the links in my description. And until next time, uh, Spy Guy out. Peace.